On May 11, 1930, a young woman called Mary Ann MacLeod from Tongue on the Isle of Lewis stepped aboard the RMS Transylvania from Glasgow to New York City in search of a better life. There, she met Frederick, whose father had emigrated to America from Germany as a 16-year-old boy. And together, Mary Ann and Frederick raised five children. Mary Ann's middle son would return to Scotland years later the home of his MacLeod ancestors, whose clan motto is, I burn, but I am not consumed. And here, in the name of progress and profit and executive golf, he would pit himself against time and tide. And in his wake, the shifting dunes of Balmedy and Aberdeenshire would never be the same. The marbled metamorphic rock of Lewis is two thirds the age of Earth, amongst the oldest on our planet. It knows about power and it's seen a lot. And so I wondered, what might it have to say about the inauguration tomorrow in Washington DC of the 45th President of the United States of America, Mary Ann McLeod's middle son, Donald? And this is what The Rock told me. O oh, son of Lewis, lonely boy, hewn from granite, salt, and sky upon a foreign shore. The ocean is a mirror gleam in which you see yourself and nothing more. Three billion years of gravity, of strata forged in fire and earth, the stone crib of your mother's birth in which your forebears lie. I am alive, I am a tomb. I burn, but I am not consumed. I burn, but I am not consumed. Fish may swim at your command across the Atlantic to the land of dreams and self-belief and boundless chance, an exile tale, an immigrant dance. You're captain of a frigate now, so set your compass, raise the mast, Blow up the sails, erase the past and future if you must. Together we can stand and watch the peatland turn to dust. But this is your apprenticeship. The Gulf Stream doesn't know your name, nor does the splendid blazing sun that alters how the currents run. The north wind never heard you roar. You're fired, you're fired. My back might burn, the blaze run wild, but I am not consumed, my child. The minch blows up a spindrift storm, the macker shifts, the macker moans. From Uig Bay to Luskin Tyre, the gale blows fast, the tide flows higher. The shore erodes and disappears, and meantime, you are stoking fears and stacking hope into a pyre. You strike a match. Your mother was a wee girl once who played upon Meroki shore and you you are a broken boy and you want more and more and more you build a tower you build a wall you live in fear that they might fall you who see nothing but your own face in the sheen of the Hudson River oh my baby Balancing is yet to come, although by then you may be gone and leave a desert to your sons and daughters. Still these waters, they will rise. The North Sea Har will cover your eyes, despite your appetite for lies and your disregard for truth. Three billion years of gravity, a strata forged in fire and earth, the stone crib of your mother's birth, in which your forebears lie. I am alive, I am a tomb. I burn, but I am not consumed. I burn, but I am not consumed.